Hello viewers, welcome to our channel Planning B6. Today we are here with a new topic and very important topic which is how we can upload our documents or work products in Premavira B6 software. How we can assign that document to our project, our activities and our WBS and how we can share the same file with the client or the top management which are not here with us and how they can find these documents, the complete detailed tutorial. So move to the topic. I have already opened my Promovira P6. Open it. First of all, the first step is just as I told you in my previous videos that how you can manage this toolbar. Manage this toolbar with the you can see here the WPS and documents. Check it. Okay, you can see here the WPS and documents. However, you can show this symbol from the project. Here is WPS and document. These two methods you can open it by clicking this one or you can open it by clicking this one. Now, in general, for the documents, for the project, the documents, you will upload documents here and then add to their activities. So, first of all, you have to go with this sign by add one document. So, new document, just say document number one. Document number one, reference number, reference number, just say planning P6, P6, 001 you will mention your document reference number status what is the status approved document category you can select the document category from here all categories are here you can search from here and the document categories are there you can see these all categories all document categories are here change orders training aids contractors techniques sample products work order what is this just say project management and add the category by clicking this button okay now you can see here in general this document in general document this one reference number this one version if version one two three whatever revision is that then you can change the category from here you can change the status from here as well and revision date is 5th july 2021 other let's say learning p6 this is a deliverable check the deliverable if this is not deliverable then don't check it description just write your description here by clicking the modify description of document just for example submitted on 5th July 2021 if you have any other description you can add from here you can change your description font from here bold you can change all method color if you want to write any other color you can select from here blue okay okay then if you want in center this side these all you can change modify from here okay your description is here now in the files you will upload a file for the private and public equations the private location is that which is in your system and public location is that which you can share with the others the public location you can use here the two options 
major two options you can upload your document on any cloud server domain or you can upload on drives like google drive uh, drive for apple and so on you can upload and you can share that file when you will share this file with your clients then clients will download the specific document from the drive and you will put that drive link here in public location now we will assign as a private location okay we just upload a document i have just created four or five simple pages as a document example document document one we can upload this document one you can upload the document in excel file in word file any of file and also if you have too many documents then then you can upload a zip folder compress zip folder you can upload there so first of all we will upload a document number one open okay then assignment for the activity assignment you will assign the activity assign the WBS you can see here we will assign these documents to activity they, this window is for the project we will assign by the activity this is for request for inspection is for ins excavation suppose that and assign this document to the and uh, if this is a work product then check on the work product now user defined fields customize user defined fields if you want to customize this user defined field from here this is the deliverable status you can add any of your required document name or number cancel okay this is how you can upload a documents we will upload two or three documents then you can understand this one document number two the same copy this one and paste here just say on hold what is that this is presentations suppose that presentation with the same method you can add from here here right your name uh, with who is the author name author of the document then this is also this is not deliverable description if any you can write here files private location we will give to the document too okay public location you can give from your computer as well but when you will share with any other system then these links will not work see this document you can upload this folder as a public then assignments activity assignment assign the activity just say length beam okay if you want to assign the wbs just go to the assign wbs and go to the this one you can assign the entire wbs to that one this is also not our product this may with this method you can upload now how you can see these documents are assigned to your projects with this method you can see here by clicking this one which documents are assigned the all documents are here also you can use this this document by printing or exporting in a file after that you can use as a document delivery schedule of the project and you can track the documents very easily this is how you can assign the documents so we will just uh, see our documents just go to the activities and uh, for the activities if you want to add a column you can see here the documents by sorting these columns then find by the work products work products and wbs there double click on it or move by this button align with this one then apply okay here you can see the documents are this one you can see here by the double clicking you will 
see the document so how you can see this documents what is the document and where it is uploaded then you just active your glow tab and here is just customize as i described in my previous videos customize that table this is wps and documents okay and then apply okay this is wps and documents for this activity yes document is assigned this document you can assign from here and if you go, if you want to see the document then go to the document and you can see here the document status with the description if you want to see the individual document then launch it by clicking launch you can see the document this is pdf document this is document which we uploaded on the Primavera v6 software by and assign to our activity by this method you can see the document then how you can create a report or add, add any other document then go to the enterprise then user defined field if you want to add some document other document then go here in this tab you can see here the work products and documents this is you can add a new deliverable status something else if you want to add by clicking add just say project project management and what is this one is project management and click on the start date close this bar after that if you want to generate a report of your documents you can print this file as well by this view you can print this file and you can also customize these these categories by right clicking here columns default version or customize we want to customize here by using the user defined which we have generated their column this that column is project management here yes we want this there at the end then also for the journal and defined you can see from here deliverable okay then private location if you have project revision date revision date okay and version okay then apply and okay you can see here the all data and you can print from here as a pdf or from the printer close this view and now we will generate a report by using go to the tool and then go to the report wizard after the report wizard if you want to use the use current screen it means this screen you can use by this one our new report just carry on with the new report click next okay from here you have to found your required report which you are want to generate document assignment document categories document statuses and then work products or documents also there by default this at the last you can select this one and click next now available areas and now selected subject area we want these two okay next next then you have to select your column which you want to generate a report okay we want in column status After that, these are the suppose that these all we want column, and from the user defined project management, apply, and then group and sort. Click on group and sort. Check this one, and show grand totals. Yes, I want to say see this grand totals, and uh, high difficulty. If any 
activity is empty hide if you want to hide hide click it and then sort and group by brands then show totals from the top on the top you can see the overall value on the top then if you want to see the activity id then check here apply ok filters here is the filters if you want to print a specific for the from this one you can print as it is if you want to assign the filter you can assign like this one just say document category is equal to which one if you want to print for the project management just say presentation add apply ok then it will show the presentation ok next work products and documents yes i want next run report after the report you can run report from here in print preview directly email html file or this is text file yes we want in text file and give the location to the file here on desktop save and however you can change your report name from the previous tab whatever you want now the report is deleting ok after the next save report yes i want to save that report the report was saved as work products and documents ok finish minimize this tab this file is which we have generated from our Pranavira P6 software. Now you can format in Excel as you want and whatever you want to delete, you can delete it. Now you see here, status, document, what is this, then assigned yes, deliverable, author, description, project public location and then revision date is there this all we selected in the filters and columns then it will be shown here you can see here like this this is the complete detailed method how you can assign and print your documents to the your projects and how you can track your documents easily with this method and for your kind information too many planning engineers don't know how we can upload, assign the documents are free from Primavera P6. This video tutorial is very important. If you are satisfied with this one, please give your opinion on this video with the comments and please like, share and subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching. Allah Hafiz.